CW Superboy, Super Suit came to be. Before we start, subscribe, hit that notification bell, like, share, and leave a comment below to think about this DC superhero video. With that being seen, it's time to suit up. In my last Superboy video, I talk about how Adam Griffin. <sighs> the Superboy of the CW Arrow Universe, which is about to become dead now. Poor Arrowverse. Poor Arrowverse. And when I say CW Superman Lewis, it's time for Superboy. I mean that. It's like you have to you have to clean out your ears. That means I'm talking about the whole ear. I'm talking about get a scoop. Scrape it. Dump it. You gotta listen while I'm trying to tell you. Subscribe to that my video channel. Help me, please, help me, please. <laughs> because there's no point in the fact that Superboy, Alex Griffin, I mean I had to do a comparison, a comparison image to, 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 to this, his, his image from the series to a artwork of what he would look like with the su super suit on. I'm not joking. Do you not see what I'm seeing? CW best stop playing. They're going to make a whole lot of fans come after every single one of them. CW, we coming for you. <laughs> we coming for you. We want Superboy. We want Superboy. <laughs> Pick and fix it all. I said pick a fence. But yeah, if you want to see how a dude who name is Jordan Kent being a super boy, I mean, nobody even noticed, but Lewis said, what if we had two boys doing crisis of Fenty Earth? <laughs> I mean, it's like... <laughs> Superboy came to be because the comic. And, well, in the comic, he said, don't ever wear this again. Really? Really, Clark Kent? Let me tell you something right now. You put on that suit, you went to college. Guess what? Superboy. You know what I'm saying? Do you understand what I'm saying to you? That scene. Superboy. People gave us hints and clues throughout the years of wonder who would be a true Superboy. Would it be Connor Kent? Would it be, you know, Jordan Kent? John D. Kent? Either way, we want to see the Superman and Lewis Superboy. DC. DC and CW need to get together and say, we need to create this. I mean, who thought the Man of Tomorrow verse will be connected to the CW Arrowverse? Now you're thinking, what? That don't make no sense. Oh, my friend, let me tell you something make a whole lot of sense. Did you not see what he was wearing in the movie, in the comics? That's the same suit that Jordan is wearing in the series. So please, tell me this. You got to tell me this. You do not see that they might have some connection to the... Superman, Man of Tomorrow verse. It's like we're watching a video inside of a movie inside of a video. And you're like, okay, that did not make no sense. Think about it. Popping out, coming back. Because one, I think I know how his super suit going to truly come to be. It's going to be where our very own 
Alvers Vibe, known as Cisco Ramon, who helped design the first flash suit. Think about it. Think about it. I'm going to give you some time to think about it. And then, all of a sudden, final season. What? Yeah, that's what I'm getting at. The final season. He created the suit that said was supposed to be in that little vault where the reverse flash, ear bought on, who was be Harrison Wells, image of him wearing that big red suit with the yellow boots. I mean, come on, Cisco Ramon, after all, think about it. You cannot create a super suit unless you have who? Cisco Ramon. Because by the time Jordan go off to college, he's going to be wearing that super suit under his clothes. Jordan college years, Superboy version. Oh, yes. I want to see that that Arrowverse version of him going to college and wearing that super suit as Superboy. Yes. Why? Because Cisco Ramon. How you think? Because one, either way, how you look at it. He's going to have a design where. Boom, 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 boom. Everything. Leading up to him wearing. That's that, that grown man, grown adult. Superboy super suit. The next Superman. Put it like that. My bad. I'm just saying. Because one. It's the question. Superboy choose suit. That's what I'm saying. Superboy choose suit is going to be designed and created by Cisco Ramon. It get a vibe. Cyber vibe. Please, seriously? It's vibe. Not cyber vibe. Vibe. No matter how you look at it, it's vibe all the way. Because <sighs> one, if we help get this message out there, have him just make a good appearance of giving him his true Superboy super suit, we gonna get this for everybody. Atticus Griffin, AKA CW's Arrowverse Superman and Lewis super suit. Superboy suit. Superboy super suit. Superboy super suit that Arrowverse CW's Lewis, I mean Superman and Lewis, it's gonna have to be because one, this is this is gonna be like man, man up tomorrow version. Then our first version. Then by the time this happens, who get the mantle next? <laughs> well, we don't know who's gonna get the mantle. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Can you dig it what I am saying? Yes. <laughs> All right. And that's just me saying something. Really? So let me ask you a question. Are you ready for this version of the CW Hourverse? Alex Griffin to become a true Superboy? I'm just asking. I'm just saying. I'm just wondering. Who here agrees? Oh, what a shame. So with that being saying, oh, I'm your boy Chris Blackthorne Harris. When it comes to knowing my superheroes, especially my DC superheroes, I know how to suit up. 
d'huile. 